Well, Bishop Heelan is a Catholic high school here in Sioux City, and that's one of the things is, you know, I think it separates us from the other schools in town is that, you know, we teach the faith, we teach the, the Catholic faith and emphasize the gospel values and the teachings of Jesus Christ. Um, we're a school of about 520 kids. Um, and with that, you know, it's kind of interesting because I think sometimes people know us only for athletics, um, but we have a great uh, extracurricular program that includes athletics, certainly. Um, we've won numerous state championships. We have a very rich tradition, um, take a lot of pride in our activities. But on top of that, we also have wonderful fine arts. Uh, we have a great marching band, jazz band, concert band, which has doubled in size in the last five years. We have uh, wonderful concert choirs, show choirs, um, clubs. We have Quiz Bowl. We have a great debate team. We've had national champion debaters in the last uh, 10 years. Um, like I said, our choirs and bands just came back. They received all Division Ones, which is almost unheard of. We have excellent clubs, mission clubs. We have uh, clubs dedicated to serving Mass and working with our faith. We have uh, clubs. We have National Honor Society, Student Council. Um, basically, we have everything you need at Bishop Elin to give your student the most well-rounded experience they could ask for. We have three feeder systems, uh, Sacred Heart, uh, Modern Day, and Holy Cross that feed into Bishop Elin High School. And uh, there's an old saying that says, uh, it's what uh, goes into the jello before the mold sets that really counts. So that's why we think it's so important for, the, uh, for our families to, to come early. Really, we, uh, we want to get the kids in the pre-K pre to kindergarten age group so that they can be a product of our system all the way through. Because we, we do feel there's so many valuable things that we have to offer, not only at Helan High School, but in, in our grade schools as well. Do you also have the... Uh, the Christ factor. I think having uh, Jesus in your, your liturgy and in your classroom every day is, is something that you, you really can't even put a price tag on. Uh, I think it's the service projects, the, uh, the values that are taught in the classroom, and the, the family, the, the family feeling of, of being a member of, uh, of our school system. Whether it's at a Friday night football game, at our hoopla to start the school, school year out, uh, there are so many positive things that really bring a family together. And, as we know in today's society, the, the family structure suffers quite a bit. And so I think if you can extend your family th through your school day, it uh, it's only helps uh, the American family. Um, we were looking at preschools. Um, we had look at, looked at a couple of different options in the city, and that was the first year for our son Jacob to be in a formal setting for preschool. He'd been at home that whole time. and. We came in, the Kitty Crusaders was just starting, so it was his pilot year, and I felt that the minute we walked in the door, it was going to be the best fit for our family. I like the feel of the school. I, I did go to a small school myself, and I got that feel from it. It was more of a personal atmosphere. Uh, you really felt that the teachers cared about the kids. It was more like a family. My main things, probably the biggest thing is we're small enough where it's like a community feel. Like every, I can walk by every single person in the school and know their name, and people genuinely care about each other, and we're always there for each other, you know, through the good things and the bad things in life, and um, that's one of the main things. And I, I see that on like I was on the part of the football team, and that was a big thing for us. We, you know, just the team bonding, and we're just a family. And like people can say that, but I feel like it's really true here. But really, it's uh, just about caring about others, uh, really sh being a shining example, um, especially with our Christian faith, and that's something I want to really institute in my career field. When we, st we stress academics, we have a, a very committed uh, core of teachers, uh, some new, some who have been here for up to 40, 45 years, and I think all that blends into the high academic standards that, that we have here at Healand. Our test scores consistently rank uh, above state, local, national averages which we're very proud of. And, uh, and I, also, I also believe though that we don't just teach to the high-end student, we teach to every student and we have the resources available to help every student succeed in our school system. For sure in the last four years we've had 100% graduation rate. Every, uh, every student through Bishop Elan has graduated from high school. Um, we also send over 95% of our students on to colleges. Um, a lot of our students go on to uh, four years but we also uh, a number of our students go to two-year colleges. Some will enter the workforce, some enter the military, which uh, accounts for the number of students. Um, one thing we're really proud of is that everybody has a plan leaving high school. 
Everybody has an idea, a focus, a career. They're all moving on. Nobody's undecided about where they're going to go next. We have three guidance counselors that work with our students. Um, they work really, really hard with them and work on getting them college scholarships, placements, internships, uh, grants, whatever they need to go on and be successful as citizens um, beyond high school.